Hello guys, it's the red one here, coming at you with another unboxing video. Now this is a PS4 charger stand for your controllers. Now, I've been wanting to do this video for a good while because, you know, I do have a charger stand right now. This is the charger stand I have right now, but I actually got this one by mistake. I wanted the charger stand where, you know, you plug the controllers into the stand and it charges them on the stand. Whereas this one's where, you know, you get two wires with it, you charge them with normal DualShock Air cable wires on a stand this one was different i didn't really i didn't want this one i got it by mistake but this is the one i'm using however now i have a different one i have the proper one where you actually put the controllers on a stand and there's, there's a charger uh, there's a charger cable that's uh you know plugged into the stand if you know what i mean it's a uh, you understand when i get it out and it says i've noticed it's just said in here it says um for ps4 slim and pro so I've noticed that it says 4 Slim and Pro, so is it not for the original PS4? Because it'd be kind of weird if it wasn't, but you know. But you know, it's, um, it only cost me 7 quid, and it's really good. That's actually a good picture of what it looks like. So we're going to have an unbox of it now. I've been really looking forward to getting one of these. Oh yeah, this is what I'm talking about. If you can see, there is a charger cable plugged right into it. So you actually stand these on a charger stand that charges it for you, not just a stand for your controls. You see that, you know, this is both, which is really cool. This is the main stand part. I believe you plug that in there. Now this just came with one charger cable. Not that I'm going to be needing it because, um, you know, I've already, this is quite a small charger cable. I'm going to be using bigger ones. The one, I'm going to be using the, you know, the normal ones that, stretch quite far but you know I still I could still I'm still going to keep it as a backup one so now it's just putting this together which uh, is going to be incredibly easy Okay, so the charge stand is fully set up. This is uh, going to be really cool. Obviously, there's a little plug in the back where you plug in the cable. Then it char it powers the two um, power things there, and then obviously it charges the controllers. So now we move on to well the control. So this is one of my main best controllers. It's a blue one. I was actually um, thinking of selling this one at some point and um, getting a different color. But you know I've had this one for a long time. Works. It works perfect. It's really nice. Now I have my plain black controller. This is just the original default one that comes with any black PS4. And now I have one that I'm sure you guys have seen before. The um, DualShock Death Stranding PS4 controller. This is massively limited edition. It's so cool. I am um, imagining you've seen this before when I obviously unboxed the um, Death Stranding con And now the limited edition Army Camo controller. Got this one from Argos. This one's really cool. So I have quite a lot of um, cool limited edition controllers. So now we're going to see what these look like on the stand. Okay, so the stand is fully plugged in and set up. As you can see, these uh, LED lights that power it up, it looks really cool. This is like such a good uh, standard system for your console. And you can get these for the PlayStation 3 as well. I actually used to have one years and years ago when I first ever had a PS3 back in 2010. So, you know. And the first controllers are on the Army and the Blue one. Now, that looks extremely cool. This is going to be a really cool way to charge them. And it really just show the controllers off as well. Yeah, that is really awesome. I'd recommend getting one of these. I got this on eBay for uh, £7. Now, getting these on other stores, I wouldn't recommend it. Because I was looking on some of the shops, I can't fully remember the names, but some of these were like 60 quid. And you know, that you know, they're not good deals, so I'd recommend going on eBay to get one of these things. These charger stands, you'll find good deals on eBay, you know. I didn't really trust eBay at first because I thought, you know, everything's in second hand, but there's actually a lot of um, self made companies on eBay that get things second hand and then refurbish them back practically brand new, which is really awesome that I didn't even really know about. And now we have the Death Stranding controller and the uh, black controller. 
Now these look really nice in it as well. I thought um, the yellow one, well, the you know, the Death Stranding controller and the black controller would go better on the charger stand together because obviously, you know, yellow and black colours, they do match, they do go together. So that looks really cool. I've been, uh, this has been a really good unboxing video to do. Uh, these uh, controllers look really nice on it. So guys, this is the end of the video. I really hope you enjoyed this um, controller unboxing with um, the charger stand. I really hope you enjoyed it because it was a real fun to do.